and put it in bags or boxes. Uh, I've got the great big van outside and it's full 20 foot container, 26 foot. I put my speakers and everything in there. But what was what was really amazing to me is now I'm sitting here looking around my room now that all my clippings and pictures and all doodads that are in the window sills and all the found objects and all the they're all gone I put them all away in boxes today and when I look around the room it looks just totally devoid of any personality and I'm about halfway out of this room I still have some stuff but it looks naked and it the thing that really struck me is when I was 18 my mother lay dead dying in a in a, I guess even going out of focus my mother uh, laying dead dying in a hospital bed you know right there right on the edge the day before and then I looked at her the day after because it was kind of a weird thing where I went down to Laguna Beach to get a house ready for her and I was at Laguna Beach the night she died they called me and told me and then I drove up but anyway I looked at her and there was nothing there Whatever that was, it was my mother, had just gone, man. It was just gone. And what I was looking at, just, it was like clay. It was, I was so blown, I was really blown away. I, it was, and this room is what brings it all back at, so clear, because now I'm looking around this room, and it's devoid of my character, whatever that is, all my interests. And they're all in boxes, and it all goes into a container. In fact, the neighbor across the way that's been here for 10 years saw my van out there and said, are you moving in? And I said, no, I'm being evicted. We're all moving out. All 28 cabins are being evicted. And he was just completely blown away. It's like, and then he told me about some trouble he was having with the Forest Service, and I guess they got some great plans for this campground. And I, uh, you know, it's like I'm looking around this room, and it's a weird feeling. And then I, there's that stuff going on out there, and it, I really have, this is really one of those Zen moments of letting go and just go with the forest because it is really interesting. So I got this big truck. I emptied my 20-foot container. And I'm figuring there's a cop bought a ton of stuff and I picked it up twice. And I'm looking at myself going, no shit. Human bodies are just amazing. I can do that. I mean, I'm a little bit tired, but no siree. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of amazing. I mean, I got tired, I'll have to admit, man. I think I had it really close to, to heat, heat uh, prostrate, you know, where you pass out from too much heat, but I had enough good sense to go in and take a cold shower. But <clears throat> it's interesting.